is going to help us. Ooh. Hey guys, David Fine and the lovely Sophia. Miss Sophia, we're here on Priscilla. Sophie's first time on Priscilla. So we actually got to drive her for the first time. Yes. But the purpose for today's video is that we're gonna show you how to attract and catch wild shiners. Guys, super easy. A lot of people go and buy them, spend like, I don't know, 10 them. or 11 dollars a dozen. No bueno, we don't like buying bait. So we're gonna show you how to catch them yourself. Check this out. Don't forget to subscribe and oh okay, we're going back. <laughs> subscribe. What else? Oh, and click the bell notification to get notified when we post our awesome new videos. Yeah. Like we need like awesome and like like that big, like bright. Bam, yellow. all right. Yeah, okay. <laughs> You're super excited about it. Sophie's excited. We're gonna go and catch some shiners. We're gonna show you how to do it. Check this out. Watch oh, it. Sophie's getting hit. With a little bit of vanilla extract. Okay. Oh, I guess more that vanilla. Okay. Oh, there's shiners hitting right here. Look at that. Here, look. This is all we need to do. We don't need a lot. Yeah, just toss it in. Ready? Yeah. And then what we do is we tie off right here like this. We don't need a whole lot. Okay. This, the first thing we're going to do we just have a little bit of water ready. Here. Is that our bucket? Yeah, it is. I don't remember that. <sighs> okay. And don't sis. All right, it's enough to start. Okay, Rolls, we're, we're camped out right in front they're actually in back of the Rolls house. How you guys doing? Good. You guys doing good? Yeah. And Lorenzo, what are we here trying to get? Shiners. Shiners. A little cold, a little chilly. Sun's starting to go down. Uh, and what we're going to do, Lorenzo or Sophie, why don't you start filming there, is we made some very special sauce that Ew. is going to help us. Wait, did you barf in it? No, this is not barf. This is steel cut oatmeal with a little bit of vanilla extract, okay? Oh, I can smell that vanilla. A little bit of sugar. Uh-oh, they're ready for What we're gonna do is we are gonna start chumming for shiners, guys. And hopefully the whole goal of this is the oatmeal should sink, but I put some bread particles in there that will float. So if the shiners start coming, they should, we should start seeing them on top, okay? So what we'll do is we'll, we're throwing that in there and we're gonna throw it on this side a little bit too. The trick is you shouldn't need a whole lot. In fact. They're starting to disappear one by one. So you can kind of see it. You kind of see it floating down? Yeah. The oats right. sink and the bread floats. And they're all mixed mixed together with the same goodness. Oh, they're starting to already eat it. You start, starting to see them? Look, look at that. Look at the bread floating. All right. So the whole thing with chumming, guys, is you got to be patient. Yeah. Sorry. So you got to wait, guys. You got to wait until the chum starts to work, and the fish start to get really excited. So you don't you don't want to start casting right away until the shiners are here. So. All right, guys. So we've been waiting about. 10, 15 minutes, and what's happening is the shiners are starting to eat, but they're not eating on top. They're actually waiting, and I can actually see them once the particles drip down a little bit and sink. We'll start, we'll start seeing the, them, they start disappearing, and I'm actually seeing the fish eat them as they sink. So we're gonna be a little bit more patient, and we're gonna throw some right in front of the boat and get them going right in front of the boat. So when I'm ready to cast, it's gonna happen, and it's gonna happen big. Here we go, guys. We're gonna see how, just how many shiners I can get with my net on the first cast. And it's the big net. And it's the big net. We're gonna need like big, big net, net, like on okay. the bottom. Okay, back up a little bit. And we're blasting in the head. 
Should we like start the engine oh, or something? Uh oh. Oh boy. I got a ton of them in there. Yeah? Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, I can see them already. Ton of them in there, guys. Oh my god. Go. Oh my. That's a lot. Well, I don't want to call it a ton. Oh, I right, got to open up that uh, can. Wow, oh, that looked a lot bigger in the water. That did, it, didn't it? Oh, there's like three of them right there. There's two right there. Get them out. Oh, yay. Okay, now get the weeds out. Sorry, I can't, I can't have this. Uh -oh. Okay, get the weeds out. Come on. Because I thought I'd let one go. Now we got at least a dozen. Yeah. Really? That's it. It at least only a dozen. seems like six. No. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. That one looks like it's only. Doesn't that hurt them? Oh! Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, they're all tearing it up right near the surface right now. There we go. Oh, not nearly as nice as a cat. But yeah. That one kind of. But. I'm going to see if I can get it. Oh, before it gets in the weeds too much. I don't know. Trying time. You There's only like three. You only four. got like two or four. Oh, There's like four. There's five. five or six. I want to try one with the little net. Okay, I'm going to try some. Can I try one with the little net? Yeah, you can try. Yeah. Hold on, hold on. Let's make sure we get let's, let's clean up first. Clean up, clean up. Let's get all the little grass out. Ooh, hello, little fishies. Hello. Is, that, is that what you threw? You threw it's right raining. there? It's Okay, go ahead and throw. It's raining. There he goes. All right, Lorenzo's going to try and catch some shiners with the five-foot net. Okay, reel it in. Oh, I got one. Get him in, get him in. Get him in. Sure? Yeah, I got two. You got one. You got a dinker. <laughs> I got one. You got, two. got two. You got two. You got two. And the child. Okay, Lorenzo. Oh, this is a little dinker. Oh, those can be like the uh, live dinker. Yeah, man, look at that. Lorenzo's first castinated shiner from his new boat. All right, guys, which one would you prefer to use for bait? What size shiner would you like? Comment down below if you'd rather use this one or this one. Big or small? Big or small. Either way, get in the pot. They're both big. This is 22, 24. All right, guys, so there you have it. Catching shiners. We're coming for them. We got about almost almost 20 shiners and two casts. And we could have probably done better. The eelgrass is so thick that the net doesn't sink and a lot of them escape underneath. But... So guys, hope you liked the video. Subscribe, like, and share. I hope this was informational for you. You can get shiners. You don't have to buy them out at the tackle store for 10 bucks a dozen. You can catch them all on your own in about 15, 20 minutes. So guys, until next time, watch your lip and okay. we'll see you out there.